Wow. Next, uh, I mean, I'm a total French car guy. And uh, all I do is uh, restore and show French cars for the public. So we open a museum in Oxnard, but it's really for the public to share French cars, because nobody really understood in the 30s that French cars were the ultimate in automotive design and performance and engineering and in art deco. Uh, and it's never been replicated since then. So will you drive this car, I mean, is, or is this going to a place to keep it safe? Well, I mean, I do have this museum, but I will definitely drive it. No, I drive all of our cars. <laughs> take them on rallies, take them out. I think that, no, there's two bad things that happen with cars. One, you don't drive them, and one, you drive them too much. So I try to pay attention to that. So how is this one to drive? Well, it's fabulous to drive. I mean, once you figure out this complicated transmission, total gearbox, etc., etc., <laughs> then, of course, it's a dream to drive. And, and can you describe this roof? I mean, it's a very unique roof. Well, this roof rolls down from the top. There's these rectangular windows. The nice thing about it is when you roll it all the way down, the last rectangular window uh, allows you to see out the rear view mirror, <laughs> which is very important. Absolutely. It's almost the uh, it's almost the progenitor of the retractable hardtops of today. Isn't it? it is absolutely that, and it's driven by. Uh, uh, two-cylinder electric motor that's in the trunk. Oh, really? So, I mean, if it was uh, easy, like just roll it back with your hands, then Gabriel Bazan wouldn't have done it. <laughs> so he builds a whole special engine just to run the truck back. What, what is the full name of the car? I want to make sure I got it right. Uh, uh, no, no. Uh, Bazan. Uh, Aero Dean, A E R O, is an airplane, D Y N E. Right. And what's what your full name? Yeah. Well, no, no, no. The name of the company was Avion, Avion Boisan, which is airplane Boisan. Right. But Aero Dean is a full name. I thought there was something else after that. Uh, C 27? Pleasure. Yeah. <laughs> no. I, I don't think there was uh, there was just a handful of them made, and uh, you know they're they're unusual cars. I mean, it, 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 you either love Boisan or you don't, but when you get hooked, you get hooked. So I'm hooked on Boisan. Other than the uh, fabric, what was the toughest job in restoration? Well, I don't know if you guys know a lot about sleeve valve engines. You probably do, because that's the Willis Knight from the early 20s, late 20s. But the sleeve valve engine is one of the most complicated things of all time, because the cylinders move up and down, and so there's the exhaust and the intake holes in the cylinder. So the cylinders move, and uh, if you don't get it right, you don't have it right. Now, it's very, very quiet, but someone always said that, Peter, if you have a Boisan that doesn't smoke, then there's something wrong with the engine. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Can you show much. us a trophy? Uh, sure. Congratulations. It's fantastic.